is uh, there about the preparation for the game against Seska. You know, they are flawless in Europe. It's a very difficult game. Uh, yeah, you know, uh, we, we all remember what happened when we were in Moscow. So uh, we got a lot to rectify from that game. Uh, we've been really focused so far this week. Uh, we've got two great days of practice so far. Uh, some good video that we've watched as well. So uh, we've done all the steps uh, necessary to, to be very, very ready tomorrow night. You guys are in a very good momentum uh, lately. And that kind of game, you know, you can maybe take you uh, one step ahead. But it can also uh, bring you back. Uh, Backwards. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that true of any game, though? So. Uh, no, but uh, especially against Chelsea. Yeah. Well, they're they're a tough team. You know, any uh, any weaknesses we have tomorrow, uh, they're going to expose. So, uh, we've done all we can so far to uh, you know to get ready. Uh, we've practiced really well, and um, you know we're just we're going to come ready to game and see what happens. Will we different from the last time we saw them? Yeah, I think so. Uh, you know, we got we got a lot more experience under our belt as a team. Um, you know, these last few weeks, uh, we got up off the, uh, you know, out of the gutter, so to speak, and, and really recovered from a bad stretch, and that builds character, so hopefully the, we can use that tomorrow night. Jake, you personally, how do you feel, you know, before two weeks, you are, uh, you know, maybe the 11 or 12, 12 player of, of the team, and now you are a starter. Is there a question? <laughs> yes, it's a big difference. You know, it's a big difference from uh, minutes, minutes on the court. Uh, how you struggle, and uh, it's uh, almost uh, a dream come true, no? Uh, it's, it certainly feels good to be out there. Uh, you know, that's that's the nature of basketball. Sometimes you gotta wait your turn for an opportunity, and um, you know, uh, it's unfortunate that uh, you know some opportunities have to come at the expense of injuries to your teammates and stuff like that. That's always unfortunate, but uh, you know, whatever the case may be, uh, I'm just trying to make the most of what what, what I'm doing while I'm out there. Jack, um, what about Silva Landsberg, please? You know, great. Uh, like yourself, you're in great shape. Also, he's in great shape. Maybe you can say some words about him. Uh, yeah, we'll still still play great on Sunday uh, when we needed him. Uh, you know, that that game was uh, you know, was touch and go for a while there. Uh, and he made some big shots that, that put us over the top. But uh, that's what we've come to expect from him. You know, every time uh, every time he shoots, you know, I think it's going to go in. It's the kind of shooter he is. And, it's the kind of scorer he is, so uh, so hopefully we get more performances like that out of him because we know he's capable of it. Your force is in your beard. Yeah, uh, well, uh, a lot of you guys uh, probably noticed a lot of guys doing the no shave November. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's sort of a uh, little uh, tradition in the United States to uh, not shave in November. So why? Why? Uh, uh, it started as uh, to raise awareness for. Uh, uh, men's cancer. So people ask you, why aren't you shaving? Like, why do you look so bad? Only this year or every year? Every year, every year. Uh, you'll notice last year too, I, I looked just as bad last year during this month. Yeah, with so, blue. I think, no? Yeah, yeah, blue had just had the mustache. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so that's, that's something I'm doing. I don't know, I might keep it though. Uh, if we keep winning, I might have to keep yeah. it. My mom doesn't want me to keep it either, but... As long as you start there, keep it. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you.